Madison Regatta is just weeks away. The annual hydroplane racing event draws in thousands, thousands of mm -hmm. people from all over the world to Madison, Indiana over the 4th of July weekend. I love that city. Madison is so fabulous. Wave 3 News and the Southern Indiana reporter Rachel Krause explains what organizers have in store to bring in more visitors than ever before. It's a quiet day on the Ohio Riverfront. Perfect for artist Amy and Britta painting the Madison Milton Bridge. Lots to paint. Oh, yeah. Lots to look at. In just a few weeks, the calm waters on the canvas will turn tumultuous as racers from all around the world come in for the Madison Regatta. Uh, estimated around 30,000 people were here for the weekend, and I fully expect that number to grow this year after all the things we've already seen, hotels being sold out, RVs sold out. Those first hydroplane boat races kicked off along the Ohio Riverfront in 1950. 69 years later, the Madison Regatta still has plenty of new things for families to check out that are coming to downtown Madison. Local manufacturer Arvin Sango donating money for a carnival and paying regatta admission for kids 14 and under. They'll have RC boats, vintage boats, and this year, the 115-year-old American Power Boat Association's Gold Cup hydroplane race will make a Madison comeback. 1980 was the last year we hosted the APBA Gold Cup Championship. It's kind of the uh, Super Bowl of sports and racing. A motorsport grant from the state will pay for a second level for the judges' stand, making it easier to see the races. And nearby, Rooster Tail Music Festival will kick off its second year with more music and well-known acts. We've got albums of the year, we've got songs of the year, we've got uh, Grammy nominees, and then we've got bands that open for the Rolling Stones. The boat races bring in people from all around the world and right here in Madison. I, I don't know why anybody would not come down on the river this year. I'll try to go this year, it'd be nice. Now I, that I can drive. I plan on going this year. The community here, ready to get these races down on paper. Absolutely. And crowds are always fun to draw. Oh yeah. In Madison, Indiana, Rachel Krause, Wave 3 News. The question is, is it going to be drawing them in the dry weather or in the wet weather? Uh, well, it's beautiful either yeah. way, especially yeah. downtown. I just love it. Yeah, they can, they can, they can handle the rain. Oh, I think it's lightning it. is what uh, is mm. a problem for them. Yeah. So hopefully we won't see that. We hopefully. Don't expect to. Yeah. All right. But rain is going to be...